I'm going to show you the numbers assigned to each specific position. And the reason you would want to know that if you don't know about me, I used to be a huge underachiever, but through obsessive self-improvement, I found my success. Earned a college scholarship, played for my national futsal team, a YouTube channel with over 100 million views. I've helped players worldwide, and I'd love to help you improve faster and achieve more. Is maybe you're watching football on TV and they're referring to different players, different positions as numbers and not just mentioning the position. Maybe you're watching an analyst speak about football so it's going to help you understand that as well also maybe your coach is giving tactical advice he's talking about soccer tactics football tactics and he's not referring to the positions he's just referring to the numbers so i'm going to give you a few different formations but the numbers of the positions are the same the formation may shift a bit but the positions stay the same so it would go like this the goalkeeper is number one right fullback number two, left fullback, number three, left center back, number four, right center back, number five. And for these formations, I'm just gonna keep a back four, but we'll do a couple different ones. One, two, three, four, five. Going into the midfield, six, eight, nine, 10, 10. The attacking midfielder is a 10, defensive midfielder is a six, the eight may go forward and join the 10. He may stay here with the six, but specifically attacking midfielder is a 10. Defensive midfielder is a six. The wingers, seven, 11. Hey, what's up? I hope you're finding this content helpful. Watch this all the way to the end if you wanna find out which subscriber got this video's special shout out. 11 and the striker is always number nine. The big goal scorer up top, he is number nine. So let's just do a slight variation. We're playing in a 4-2-3-1 right now. If we went 4-3-3, it stays the same. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, ten, seven, eleven, nine. Sometimes the eight may go and join the 10 and you might play with one defensive midfielder he would be the six this would be a 10 and an eight in here and seven eleven nine you could play a four one if you like this content check out the soccer success planner you can download it for free there's a link in the description below and for advanced training check out the online soccer academy four, one four one with one defensive midfielder and it would be the same a six, an eight and a 10 in here, seven, 11, and the nine up top. Let's look at a traditional four, four, two. So the same from the back, one, two, three, four, five. Up top is the nine and the 11 would join him. Nine and 11 traditionally have been the two strikers because in the 90s, 80s, it was a lot of 4 4 2. 9 and 11 were usually up top. This would be a 6 and a 10 in here. 7, 8, 9, 11. So that's basically the different positions assigned to different numbers. So, as I said, it's going to help you if anyone ever mentions maybe you're watching. Um, professional football on TV and the analyst or the commentator keeps mentioning the number six so he's such a good number six or the attacking number ten he's so good on the ball he's so creative the big number nine up top this is gonna give you a better idea of those positions so you're not confused if you ever hear those terms and also like I said if I'm playing uh, football there's 11 players on the pitch so that's why there's only 11 numbers here. Now, obviously you can wear whatever number you want. And nowadays players are getting higher and higher with their numbers, more ridiculous numbers, and it's all good. Wear whatever number you want. But if you play right fullback, maybe you wanna select that number two. If you play left fullback, three. Center backs, four and five. Midfielder, especially that defensive midfielder, six. The attacking midfielder, you're the number 10. The wingers are seven. And 11 usually if you're playing with two wingers or if you're in a if you're in that 442 it would be that seven and that eight 
But up top, if you want to be the big goal scorer, wear the number nine. 11 is a cool number as well. And at the end of the day, you can wear whatever number you want. But I hope you found this video helpful. If you were looking for soccer positions with specific numbers, if you did, please like, comment, share this video, subscribe to Progressive Soccer, and I'll see you in the next video. This is the featured subscriber for this video. If you'd like to be featured in future videos, hit that like button, drop a comment below, and let me know how my videos have helped you improve and achieve more in this sport. If you like this content, check out the Soccer Success Planner. You can download it for free. There's a link in the description below. And for advanced training, check out the Online Soccer Academy.